Yo, yo guys, Star C Mike back at it again with the Habao VSE buggy. Doing a little challenge with my buddy Martin with a 3640 motor and single 3S. Track, start, stop, read. Track, start, stop, read. Track, start, watch this number. So it is linked to the car and it is working. I got a couple cars and then I'll get her on down there. I could drive around the shoulder down there, guys, but the shoulder is so dirty and so full of rocks and all debris and dirt, so it just picks all the tires, pick it all up, so just wait for the traffic to go and we'll get her on down there. It's like my OG buggy from way back in the day man i love, I love this buggy it's, it's just amazing buggy got to turn around Let's wait for this guy to get a little farther down there Make sure he's not gonna turn, that would suck. But she is, okay good, he's going the opposite way. I don't think I touched the steering probably one time on that pass. Right now I did, at the end hitting the brakes just to keep it straight but damn this thing is freaking dialed in turn the brake up a little bit but it is dialed in damn man all i can say is guys figure it out man figure it out you don't need none of them assistance them gyros and perfect passes you don't need none of them things you don't need them you really don't just take your time come to your road that you want to stay strictly on and run on in the same direction every time and tune your car to the road that's it. Tune your car. Set your car up, you know, your droop, your ride height. Set it all up even. Everything equal. Front and rear. Red to the right. Set up everything equal. And then come out and make adjustments to the toe and the camber in order to get your car to drive laser straight. That's all you got to do, guys. Here, I'll show you before I unplug or touch anything. See, there's no rocks in this car at all. There's absolutely no rocks. Nothing. I haven't touched anything, just made a pass. Nothing. Transmitter's still on and everything. I've never, I've been doing this for a while. Not as long as most, but I've been doing it for a while. And I've never even owned a gyro rider all these years. I've never even done it. I'm, I'm, to be honest with you, I'm scared of them. I really am scared of them. I don't want some electrical device controlling my steering and when it fails you know i'm pissed i'd rather it be me failing it me causing the issue 104 guys 104 oh, i did my temp gun about 120 that's not bad at all not bad at all but uh Get this stuff turned off for you guys. I need to make one adjustment. Here we go. Put this down for you guys. As you can see the wires. See the leads. See, it is a single pack, and this is a real deal single pack. So this is a 3S, 1P. All these guys that you know, no disrespect to anybody, but all these guys that are running these, you know, so-called single packs, you know, from a certain manufacturer, they're not technically single packs. You know, that's where that 2P and that 3P comes into play. Just think about that, guys. But anyways, God bless. Peace out. 104. 3640 motor XLX 
single pack 3s 1p so bow bsc buggy peace out god bless definitely more to come